Because every artist, I think, um, number one, to get here or, uh, is to be stubborn. I think um, you've got to be, you have to love art from your gut. It's not, a, it's not about just loving art or, or it's a play thing, it's a serious work and you have to be genuine about it. As an artist, using multimedia is always it's part of an artist's curiosity. It's like using gold if it's just like using collages in your work. So gold if it's just a medium, and somehow, but I seem to prefer gold leaf over silver leaf, but I don't know why, you know. Gold is gold, gold, is, gold remains gold. <laughs> so I think it's important to have, gold is, it speaks, gold speaks to people. And I think that's, um, that's the whole idea of, of me using gold leaf, yes. Uh, it gives it, a, it, it, it adds something to your, to your work, sometimes. I see myself as maybe as a desperado, maybe, you know. I like the idea, like you asked in the first instance, how, how did I get here? And I said, I, I taken and given, fighting, I'm taking blues and giving blues. But to be an artist, you should be desperadic, if you could say that. You know? I mean, so you, you fight, you have to be rebellious, you have to be stubborn. Your work should not be too compromising, like um, trying to please. So you should just be bold, and you should be fettered by religion, where you have self-censorship or something. So you should be um, free to express yourself as you want as an artist. Because I learned a long time ago that an artist should be free to oppose whatever he wants, you know, in the proper sense. I try to, to develop myself, to have this non, inhibited um, a mentality. They prefer of sex, but sex is you and me and everybody else, so sex has a bad name. <laughs> so I think, if you say sex, oh sex, yeah, sex is beautiful, sex is nice, sex is like sun, the sun. So then you become a desperado when he uses terms like that, which is not really not, but in the social terms, we are, or as an artist, you should be a desperado. desperado.